player Glynn really trying to keep his feet on there he is, it's now Coulson into the penalty area, can he get across him? It's took a bit of a bobble over to um, Colville done really well to just stretch it out there he's now over to Jackson on his left hand side, drills in! Oh, who's that? Jackson! Jackson! Throwing now comes in, edge of the six yard box, edge of the box, it's a back here and it's two for Scarborough, the playoff finals, here we come! in a bit of danger though now they've given it away at the back and a cross comes in headed back across the danger zone it's 2-1 it's 2-1 What's the ball in from Lewis Riley? And it's nodded in by Jack. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
and uh, back to Whitley who calmly plays it to uh, Ashley Jackson long left foot drive there looking for Coulson and it's a bit of a mix up at the back here and maybe a chance for Scarborough to get in with uh, Jarvis just battling for it at the moment it's now with Maloney for Scarborough on the deck to Watson back to Maloney uh, fairly hopeful ball down the line looking for Coulson he's gonna just keep it in there in the corner gets past his man nicely could he play it to Colville could he go for goal he does and it's 1-0 Scarborough Athletic Scarborough's captain fantastic the hero yet again Oh, Han Dixon now brings it onto the left-hand side, looking for Clark. It's crossed in, and it's an equaliser from Amis for Warrington. He's now won all. Scarborough only as far as Jarvis for Borough into Heslop. He's got a bit of space in front of him. Plays it out to Luca Colville, edge of the area. Cross comes in, not really dealt with. Was that a handball? It's two-one. Scarborough, Scarborough have taken the lead again in the game. <laughs> Hard to see we've got so many fans in front of us here.